hello guys and welcome to this tutorial on how to add angular materials to the angular project here we are going to add the new angular material 6 into the angular 6 project so let's get started first of all what we need is our angular cli installed globally i've done the installation part so let me show you the, my version of angular cli by typing ng nest dash version here you can see my angular cli version is 6.0.1 so to follow this tutorial you need at least the angular cli version 6 so let's create a sample application using angular cli command go to the directory go to the project directory you wish to install angular project and type ng new and give a project a name i'll be giving the project name as angmat as angular material material and pressing enter now this will install all the dependencies and create a sample project in our directory so the process is completed now let's go to the directory by typing cd ang material now to run the project we just need to type the command ng serve and if you want to open it in browser automatically then give dash dash open flag now this will build the project and open our project in the browser okay our project has been built and you can see in the left side in our browser that angulus has provided a sample so let's open the project in the code editor i'll be using vs code so to open it i'll be stopping this stopping the project and typing code and dot to open it in visual studio code now let me realign it and delete yes. so from now on here i'll be using the integrated terminal command provided by visual studio code so as you can see here in our angular mat we have a src folder and inside there we have an app folder where we do our all the coding stuffs. Now we are going to add the Angular material to the project. So to add the Angular Matter project, let's go to the documentation first, which we can find in material.angular.io. So to add the Angular material to our application, let's go to guides, and here we have a schematics option in angular 6 and there is an option to add the angular material directly using this command ng add at the rate angular slash material so we'll be using this command to add angular material to our project so i'll be pasting this in our terminal and pressing enter now what this does is this uh, takes all the angular material dependencies puts it into our node module and configures all that is needed to use our angular material project so here you can see here we can see that it updated our package.json file angular.json and angular app module.ts index.html and styles.css so there is no any configurations that needs to be done manually so let's start our server once again by typing ng serve okay our project is running in the port 4200 uh, so let me refresh this once again okay after refreshing here you can see that nothing has changed that means our dependencies have been implemented correctly but to really check if 
it has been configured correctly we will be adding a sample metal component to our project so let's go to components and why not add a button component so to add a button component we need to do the following we need to add this import matte button from angular material so we'll go to app modules uh, let me close the side side drawer so to add the button have to open what we have to do is type import and import from angular material so what we want to add is matte button module matte button module which we are also going to add here after the comma here matte button module let's realize it okay now the matte button module has been added in the app.module.ta so to see uh, how the button looks we have to go to app.module app dot we have to go to app dot component dot html so this is the boilerplate code we saw uh, this layout in our port 4200 so we will be deleting everything and adding a component button component so to add the button component let's go to an example here in example you can see the different kinds of button that you can add you can add a basic button a raise button an icon button a fab button and a mini fab button so we'll be adding a raise buttons so by clicking this view source we can toggle between the code view and the uh, and the preview mode so to add a raise button what you have to do is you just have to copy this this code here in our app component.ts so after saving this this will automatically reload and here we can see our basic material design button so let's add a color as well so to add a color just add this attribute color equals to primary and we'll give it a name primary button so let's click on save and here you can see our button saying primary button and a blue background so guys this is how you can add an angular material to the angular 6 project so further on what we'll do is we'll be adding three templates namely navigation dashboard and the table template which we can see here again from the button guides schematic and here we can see that we have three three templates provided by the angular material team navigation dashboard and table which we can which we can use by adding this command and this generate and yeah, which we'll be doing in the next video so see you in next video thank you